But the amazing thing is that every atom in your body came from a star that exploded. And the atoms in your left hand probably came from a different star than your right hand. It really is the most poetic thing I know about physics. You are all stardust. You couldn't be here if stars hadn't exploded because the elements, the carbon, nitrogen, oxygen, iron, all the things that matter for evolution weren't created at the beginning of time. They're created in the nuclear furnaces of stars and the only way they can get into your body is if the stars were kind enough to explode. So forget Jesus, the stars died so that you could be here. When I look up at the sky and witness all the beauty, I gotta feel lucky for this very opportunity. Could have never been born, but instead I'm right here. I think about death, but I feel no fear. Hey, I accept life for what it really is. And I don't need a book to tell me how to live. I don't trust crooks that lie to little kids or profit off the weak bunch of fucking hypocrites. Tell them, tell them. You can take that preaching somewhere else. Might as well, cause you can't scare an atheist with hell. Uh -uh. I say life's a mission for truth. Call it defiance, but I've heard your best claims and I destroyed the ay, ay, science. Ay, ay. My mind was hazy, now I see clear. First off, it's amazing to be here. And by here, I mean planet Earth. Some designer too. Who but a surf wants it to be true? 